content fresh we are back with another review you know your boys get more into the youtube space and i have some luck interviewing some other products so apparently y'all like that you like hearing from me you like hearing my breakdown do this shit work or do we need to get sent back because you know we will send it back especially if i ordered it off amazon prime thank you so today's review is in regards to a Keywing seven piece lens kit. Um, you know, what did I order this for? I ordered it because I do a lot of video shooting from my iPhone 12 Max, Pro Max, get it right. And uh, I should do a lot of shooting from there. So these uh, lenses do fit that camera. They do fit the iPhone rather and um, I needed something like that to just expand, just give option to capture in a different way. Um, I'm gonna check the audio and see if it doesn't sound like And we're shit. back. Okay, so we did need to run it back real quick. I did wanna make sure that the audio is coming through correct, and I'm actually gonna check that again right now. So now we, <laughs> I don't know what that was. Now we are officially, officially back. But anyway, let's a little bit off topic anyway. So, Key Wing 7-piece lens kit. You know, why did I order this? Um, again, just to reiterate that, if I didn't say it already, I probably did say it, but just to reiterate again, I do a lot of shooting um, and video with my iPhone 12 Pro Max, and the Key Wings set for this particular set is for a mobile phone, and um, they also had I believe some fairly good reviews. Not any as in depth as I'm about to go, and none that show you exactly what it looks like, like I'm about to do. So, um, but I did order it just to expand my videography, my photography, and just have some fun things to, to kind of experiment with. It's not necessarily, um, I mean, I don't know if you can consider, what you consider professional or what can be considered professional because in this day and age it really seems like the sky's the limit um so it could be for a hobby or if you are shooting and getting paid from shooting from your mobile device it could also increase your game on the mobile spectrum um overall how did i like it um i actually had lost the pack for a while and um haven't used it in live you know like out and about as much as I would have liked to um, I think I took it to a show and I left it in a backpack um, completely forgot that it was in that particular backpack and I found it honestly like a week ago but I've been playing with them since then and overall I really like it um, I think it's really great let me guess I'm gonna get into some of the details here um yes so overall i feel like i really do like it it came in this nice black case um very simple and you open it up to find oops i might have dumped them out you open it up to find your keywing um lenses here and they also do come with lids and caps rather for the top and bottom of the lens i just took them off so i'll be able to show you guys uh, and demonstrate here in just a moment but anyway it comes in a nice honestly cute freaking cute little package like this and they do look like pretty high quality like lenses um, they kind of have a stable or this some of them are all like one solid piece and some of them seem to have a top and bottom part that kind of screws independently of itself. I don't really know what that's about, but anyway, yeah, overall, it's a very simple um, layout, very simple situation here, and I'll get into the next part of it. Um, the clip, this is your little clip that you'll be able to clip onto your mobile device. The only thing I wanted to say about this part is that they is happy to install this gasket piece, um, which is basically a little sticker and you just stick it onto there. But for some reason, when I tried to install mine, clip that would go onto your mobile phone, and when I was installing the gasket thing that I mentioned earlier, 
um, it got just a little bit of glue and like bull here and it wasn't really sticking there at the top um, however however that has not created any problem with my use of the key wing seven piece set you know it's not a 12 piece like KFC but it was it was okay for me so let's start off with the most obvious and you know the one that probably the reason why you're getting this kit and probably the reason why anybody should get this kit is the fisheye lens this is probably my favorite lens just because it creates a very just cool effect and again let me just get straight to it and put this sucker on so you can see what it do um the reason i'm like also kind of stuttering and stuff is just because i'm new to this and also i don't have any music playing so that's very nerve-wracking but I can't have music playing because of that. Anyway, let me shut up about that. This looks cool, right? Um, now you can see so much more. You can see my mic here, which you did not see that before at all. And it also creates this rim around the, the video. Um, I don't know if I can somehow make that encompass the, my entire thing because I'm actually using my webcam to test this out for you guys which is also freaking genius you know thank you very much um but it helps you to see exactly what you're getting right away now i believe when you have this on your mobile device it will appear as a full circle or you will at least be able to see more of the circle um, because it's on my imac i think maybe there's like a little bit of a slant and you're not able to see the full circular but it just creates this kind of interesting box or circular thing here and you can see again now you can see all the way to my front door um and it makes the apartment looks like <laughs> makes the apartment look like it's i don't know like smaller or just that you can see everything in this this really sick angle so have fun with this one again this is definitely um what people are probably see look at that big difference you can't see nothing now you can't see the mic you can't see the door so the power of the um the power of the fisheye lens um is very fun very fun jump to the two times zoom lens just so we can get a different perspective so since it's two times zoom that does mean obviously it is going to start just checking if my other videos sent through and I'll check that in a second after this video um, you just clean off the lenses it did come with a lens cleaner I'm just using my shirt that's my own decision but I would also recommend you guys use your lens you know what let me get my lens cleaner real quick Now, my webcam thing needs to be wiped off properly. So, okay. So this is the two times. Let's put it on, see what we got here. Wow. And so, obviously this has zoomed in um, our view from the webcam. And again, I think because I'm using this iMac, and it cannot can't really get flesh to the um the back of the computer because it's like a slope um it's that model it's like still like a slope and um yes but you can see that it zooms it in two times um, without losing much integrity of pixelation and i think for mobile devices and whatnot you know people that want to get a little bit um closer image without losing quality this is going to be a lens that helps you achieve that because again it's an optical lens um, we're not digitally zooming in and we're not losing any resolution i know some shit okay <laughs> um so and make sure you guys are liking this video and subscribing again i'm gonna come out with a lot more content because um i constantly order things off amazon and i constantly look for videos uh review videos and sometimes i'm not seeing videos that um are explaining what needs to be explained um 
and I just hope to fill that void, you know, for all those people that needed to see how these lights work, or excuse me, how these lights, how these lenses work, and um, what exactly does it look like, you know, without it being how some of those videos be out there, like you wasted time watching something, you know, like I don't even know <laughs> what I just watched. Um, now this is a very interesting lens that I'm about to show. Um, this is kind of another one of my favorites, although I have no clue what I'm going to use it for. Um, I used to have a praying mantis, which is an awesome pet, super recommend it. Um, might even make a video about mine, I think I have some videos of her. Um, yes, anyway, all right. I don't know if I can say RIP, she flew away, so I don't know if she's still alive. I mean, they usually only last or live for eight months, and that was last year, so RIP. RIP maybe, or maybe she's out there thriving in Orange County, eating roaches and crickets and all kinds of crap. Anyway, the macro lens. The macro lens is a 20 times zoom. So what it does, so now I, I appear to be very blurry, um, which is fine, because what the macro lens does is allows it to zoom in to fine print and so you can see down almost to almost like not a microscopic level but you know a lot further than you can see with your bare eyes um, you could even you can see that that sign on shout out to green body uh, this is my homegirl goddesses uh, amazing skincare line but um, you can see that I've been you know using this or opening it a lot because it's the words are worn down that's something i didn't even notice um here's oh i also have these really cool rocks so maybe if you're somebody that does a video where you're looking at the details or something this lens would allow your and your in your phone by itself would never be able to usually uh, get this close even my iphone uh, 12 pro max usually does not you know you can't get really down this close with digital zooming or whatever, moving your camera as close or what have you. And certainly this webcam camera would not be able to do something like this on its own. So again, very powerful um, optic lenses here. That was the 20 times macro, which you're gonna find in the key wing seven piece set like i said it's not a 12 piece but they're making it do the damn thing okay now what we're going to look at next is um this 120 degree lens so this is a wide angle um i believe the fish eye lens is like 180 degrees angle so it basically gets a bit ultra wide this is going to get a little bit less than that but still you'll be able to see a lot more so what i'll, I'll show you Notice the edges, notice that we can see the couch, notice that we cannot see my desk right now, and we're now putting on the wide angle. So with the wide angle on, and I really like this for vlogging from this computer, actually. If I, for some reason, I do just like it, you can see more. Um, so, what was I gonna say? I lost my train of thought. Anyway, yeah, I like this angle. It, it opens it up a little bit more. I even just looking at the camera right now, I just kind of even feel like I have more space and whatnot. But yeah, this gives you again, without having to zoom out or without having to, if your phone doesn't have a automatic, you know, wide angle feature, you can now bring this to your mobile device and begin capturing wide angles whether it's, you know, something scenic, I don't know, um, something scenic that you're trying to capture um, or something where you wanna be, maybe it's a party setting and you wanna be able to see the people on this couch and the people coming in and just like widen the scene, widen the angle for whatever creative purpose, it will allow you to now do that. So, I mean, I really do, I really do honestly um, like this entire set and I feel like it delivers just exactly what um, it it says it's going to be for the most part um, I've had no problems with 
really any of the lenses thus far. I'm gonna be doing a shoot with it very soon. Um, just clean out my lens here. This is another very interesting lens. This also might be another reason why you gravitated to this purchase in the first place, um, which is the kaleidoscope the kaleidoscope lens. So let me show you what that looks like. And it's trippy. I like it. So, you know, this, this allows you to do all kind of cool things with the kaleidoscope effect, you know, um, you could even, you could even do some pictures that are just like a half of one and do some you know, are part of the screen. I could definitely see, you know, if you're on set or you have a white wall, how you could definitely, this is probably one of the ones I'm gonna play with tomorrow in the shoot. But see, yeah, you know, and just get the right angle or whatever. I don't know, you could, you could play with it, but the kaleidoscopes. Um, and again, these should all fit better on your actual phone. Um, let me see if I can, because I know I said earlier about the uh, fisheye that it should be a complete circle. Let me test that idea out just so I can, so we can all be sure about that. Because that's what I also don't like about certain videos. I'm like, why didn't you just go ahead and, and do that so I can know before I buy this? Oh, and my theory does appear to be right. I will show you guys. So with the fisheye lens on your phone, you are getting the full 360 like circular thing, which is, that's what you would probably want for the most part. Um, even that looks cool, like taking a picture of, of uh, the computer screen like that. So you can't really see, but um, it's super f cool. So, anyway, let me put my shit back in. I apologize again for any of the bad language because I'm again learning how to be on um, here. It's new for me, so I will get better. Um, because I understand my personal conversation is not necessarily for y'all on the public entities when we are trying to discuss the things. Oh, there was one more. Wait, oh, there's two more. There's two more. There's two more. And for this one, I want to change this light up to just a normal, um, Yeah, just, just a normal light. I guess. Yeah. For this one, I wanted to just change it to a normal light, just like if, maybe as if you were doing a photo shoot or something of that nature. Um, okay. Yeah, just a little bit more light there for us. Okay. And so we got two more left. Um, this one is called a CPL lens. Um, I'm not exactly sure what that stands for. CPL. Okay, CPL is often used to eliminate or reduce strong glare of non-metallic items in color or black and white. Um, therefore eliminating or reducing the light spot and yeah that's why I wanted to turn the light on so you can see kind of how there's um, I guess like around my face there you I don't know sometimes that light looks a little bit harsh um, what the CPL lens does was really impressive to me especially for if you are on set or doing a photo shoot and using lights um, how softer this is, and I'll take it off again so you can see. So here, and then you can see for a second how that light is a little bit 
harder there on everything is real soft and or at least it gives it you know at least that much more um, of, a, of a softened look especially if you're doing photographs um, I would imagine too you know with females or those wearing makeup this is gonna help really make that look smooth I'm not wearing any makeup but it's gonna help make that look smooth. Or even if somebody's maybe sweating a lot, which in a photo shoot or around any lights, stuff like that can happen. But it's very subtle what this one does. I will say it's very, very subtle. But sometimes when you're trying to be detailed, you know, something subtle can make or break a shoot. So it's a nice one to have. I don't foresee myself necessarily using it that much. I don't know, I don't know. Um, I'm definitely going to try to use all of these as much as I can because I'm having so much fun using them. And um, this one is called the Starburst um, lens. And I really like this one too. I'm gonna bring back my colorful lights because, and now this gives you that. Okay, I don't want to get demonetized, but anyway, this is definitely giving that, you know, it's giving that Michael Jackson, um, Rock With You vibes. I hope I don't get demonetized for singing that song, but that's what this starburst effect gives me. And it also gives like this very, even without any light being shown in the background, you can see like how glossy even with my hand like here and stuff and closer to the light when I get closer to the light it starts reflecting but it gives you that it gives it like a glossy almost a retro um, vibe I feel like if I could put is there like a pink light yeah or I don't know but it just gives like a, 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 a retro vibe so all in all that is the key wing seven piece light set um, or I keep saying like the seven piece lens set. I'm really enjoying it. Honestly, I'm gonna give the product a nine out of 10 because uh, only reason I'm gonna not give it a 10, because again, it does deliver exactly what it said it was gonna deliver. Only reason I'm not gonna give it a 10 is because of this little issue here, which I mean, I don't know. Maybe they should put two in the case. So if you, if you mess it up the first time, I don't even think I messed up. I mean, it, it tried to glue on there and it just never stayed. But uh, they could maybe deliver, either deliver it with it already uh, on there or um, give you an extra try with one, you know, then I could give it 10 out of 10. But other than that, I really like the fact that they give you a nice carrying case and make everything very nice and organized for you. Um, and I love the, you know, the powerful effects of each lens and um, especially, you know, the fish eye, especially the wide angle and, you know, uh, the kaleidoscope. So many different things to love about the Kiwi 7P set. Hope you check it out. And I hope that you like and subscribe to my Carlton Fresh page right here, right now for more reviews that are coming out. And um, yeah, we hope you join us for more. So we'll check you out next time. Peace.